journey this morning. Gonna uh, drive roughly 150 miles uh, to Jackson, Mississippi. Bringing my truck up there. I'm getting ready to move. Um, I'll kind of stop along the way, keep you guys posted on how this goes. Um, hope all goes well and happy driving. What a gorgeous day for a drive today. Um, first, probably I don't know, 30 minutes or so of the trip, everything's going fine. Weather's beautiful, it's a little on the cooler side, about 55 degrees outside, so we able to ride with the windows up. Uh, no AC, no heat, and that's how these old vehicles are. Uh, I'm cruising on, uh, on the interstate here about 60, 65, 70 miles an hour, right at 2,000 RPMs. Uh, trucks perform like it should for a 60 year old truck. Um, yeah, so it's just a beautiful day out. I uh, hope you guys enjoy it. So I just had to make a pit stop, and man, I gotta tell you, it keeps reminding me. I had to go to gas just the same thing happened. You pull up to a spot when you're in an old car, and car guys, they just they talk to you. Car guys are some of the nicest, kindest people you'll ever meet. We're competitive, don't get me wrong, but man, I gotta tell you, car guys, they're just friendly, 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 so just keep it up, guys. Y'all keep up the good work. So I have a, uh, I have a 2022 Silverado, and I'm just gonna tell you, I get more waves and more smiles driving this truck than I do my silver. In fact, nobody ever waves at me in my Silverado unless they're waving the number one finger, which that doesn't happen too often. Yeah, maybe. But anyway, uh, these old vehicles, man, they're really cool to drive. They're fun. I enjoy it driving. It's just really, really, really cool. It's been a good trip. Uh, they kind of wanted, I was going to stop at another stop, but it was closed. Kind of tell you guys why, uh, why I'm taking this journey and what I'm doing. We're actually in the process of moving uh, three hours away. So I'm about two hours and a half into a three hour journey to bring my truck up to. Uh, a new place where we're going to be moving so uh, we're moving you know closer to some family it's for, for family reasons and that's the best reason to, to do anything is for family so but uh but also too uh currently i just have a two-car garage this new house that we're going to move into we're going to build a a bigger garage a 24 by 30 workshop for me to uh to work on my truck and anything else that comes up in the future so um I'll keep you posted on that as they start doing the build in the garage. I'm going to do some videos on that as well. So, we just wanted to update you guys. Man, I'm getting tons of people waving at me, smiling, which every, I've had this truck for six, seven years, and I always get that. So, one of the stops I made, man, people just, guys want to sit there and talk. And, and it's just great to talk to people about cars. So, No problems whatsoever. Truck performed flawlessly. Um, a few little knickknack things. I noticed a little oil leak on the intake manifold. I just need to, you know, retighten those bolts up. Um, nothing major, you know. Just some little adjustments. But uh, super happy to get moved up here. Can't wait to get the garage built um, and get uh, get that process going. So, all right, that's the update. Made it safe and sound. Have a great weekend.